it's your girl, I'm Lee the Dirt, and I'm back at it with the back at it, chilling with the home girl over here, Amanda Black. What's cracking, girl? How you doing? I'm good. How are you? Great. I'm so happy to meet you. I'm sure our viewers are happy to hear from you on Hip Hop 411. What's been going on with you, girl? Tell us. I've uh, been busy, man. You know, after the whole wave, you know, arriving in the industry yeah. and um, sort of like a lot of things happened to yeah. me, you know, yeah, yeah. within my career. So right now, just kind of coming off that and trying to create some more. And tell me about the wave. How's the wave been? Amazing. Yeah. Crazy and just like it, it, you can't control it because it's like, what? What's happening? Oh, oh, this. Oh, OK, OK. Ah, but it's a blessing, man, and I've just been receiving the whole time. Just been receiving and be like, okay, what can I do with what I'm getting? So right now I'm in the process, you know, I'm, I'm working on projects on how to help other people, you know. So, yeah. No, but the wave was incredible, guys. I'm still experiencing it. It is. The wave, the wave is crazy. <laughs> it's, it's happening. The wave is going <laughs> to We are within the wave. <laughs> I believe that. Speaking of projects. Standard Bank Jazz Music Festival. Here we are, Standard Bank. Let me let me tell you a story, right? With this festival, every year um, after high school, I was like, I'm gonna go. You know the fringe, right? It's for new artists, so you apply. Every year, I miss the deadline. Like like so much happens, and then I'm like, oh, Standard Bank Jazz Fest, and then I'm like, close, close every year. So for me to be Having my own show this year during the wave, uh, I'm incredibly honored because I've never been to the Grime Sound Jazz Fest. Uh, one, because my mom was very strict. She knows. So, yes, yeah, so I <laughs> I've never been able to go. So, I get to go this year to perform. <laughs> amazing. I love stories like these. It's like for people who are watching this, it's like, shit, I can do it. It could be me. You know, so you like this new, it's almost like overnight, it's, it seems like overnight success on TV. You know, how has it been for you just like your dreams coming true? For me, it's been incredible because I've always wanted this, you know, um, I've always dreamt of being here. I've always dreamt of being further even. Um, so for me, it's like I'm ticking off, you know, like bucket list, yes. So it's like career list, bucket, bucket career list. So. Um, I'm in the <laughs> Shoo, an entire bucket career. Bucket career list. Um, yeah, it's 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 incredible, man. I'm on a journey, and I I think I told myself don't get caught up in the wave, but experience it and learn from it. And right now, like a lot of my dreams have come true, and a lot more are still gonna come true. So for everyone out there who's still from back home, everybody knows if you know. You want something, don't give up on it. Because, like, who would have thought Tundana Sekuwa would be where I am right now? You know what I'm saying? Amanda Black. Amanda Black. Amanda Black. <laughs> Nobody ever imagined, except obviously me, because I saw it and I was like, I'm going there. And it's been an incredible journey, and I would wish everybody who has dreams to just go for it. You never going for it is more than just going for it. You really have to invest your energy and you need to put in work. How how's that been for you? What, what what have you gone through before reaching the wave? Yeah, okay. So for me, I've always it was be ready. Yeah. That was me. So ready. That just stay ready. When the time comes, you will be ready. Yeah. So basically, it was me perfecting my craft. I sang every day. You know, uh, vocal exercises, my guitar. Just basically trying. Although obviously, I never knew like the other things that I needed to know, like about the business. But what I did know was that I needed to perfect the craft. It's not perfect, but every yeah, it's. it's it, it, I don't think it'll ever be perfect, but it'll be at a point where you're like, I'm, I'm, I'm still building, and that's what I'm doing. It's growth. So for me, that's what I did to prepare myself, and I think I had to grow. Uh, the growth, just maturing as a woman, and I still am growing. The whole, the whole game is just progressing. It is. Yeah. As people like to isolate the two. It's such a crazy thing because we're human first and we are celebrities or musicians after. So it's kind of hard when you have to be a musician first and then be a human being. It's a tricky thing. But then it all goes with growth. It's like you can't have one. You can't be rich and be and not be popping. Dude. 
can't, you, you can't be a celebrity and not hold up a certain type of image and and how how's that been for you being a black black girl in the position you're in running shit because <laughs> you definitely are running shit for me i try what do i do i'm myself i think the one thing that i just told myself i cannot be what yeah i can't be that i can't be everything i can't be everything all at once but what i can be is me so what i decided was it happens sometimes where you kind of feel influenced or cuz I'm human and you kind of feel like a little bit of pressure and you're like now nah, me I need to be and then and then my mind says no you don't it's too much <laughs> it's too much work you know there's people that do like dressing up all the time and they're always just ready I'm not one of those people I try like I try very hard I'm just like okay I need to look professional I need to, I'm going there I need to but on a on a daily I'm pretty much me. So you're organic. I love that. Just be organic, girl. Just be your, just do you? Cuz realistically like Amanda Black is not a a princess on a daily basis. Sometimes girl you just want to unwind and just be crusty, right? Dude, that's what I do. <laughs> that's the creativity comes yourself. Just be yourself. I think for me the biggest strength that I have coming in the industry is knowing who I am and that every time obviously I'll be challenged and every time there will be like a time where I'm I'm kind of losing my way but because I know who I am coming in I know how to get back to that yeah. don't you ever forget that girl make sure you don't standard bank jazz music festival what can we look forward to for your show hey guys so 7th July ne? we're gonna be there at Grahamstown Jonga Zekaya Joe like you know what I'm saying you guys can expect a great show um bringing through my five piece band and we are going to do the things i'm very very excited i planned a a nice set for you guys i'm not going to say yeah we're going to do this fireworks or whatever but expect a great show uh we're going to be alive and we're going to wake people up yeah dope i can't wait to see it who can't you wait to see it? who can't i wait what who can't i wait to see your english is gone <laughs> Okay, who can't you wait to see who's on the lineup just like you, girl? So you know there's Femi Koya, there's a bunch of people on the lineup. Who can't you wait to see? You know. <laughs> Cuz it's not fair. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Wait. I feel very very embarrassed that I do not know who's on the lineup right now. What? Okay, that's what you call booming. Well, you just know that now I'm with the line. I don't know who else. Look, look, look. Who's on the lineup? Girl, shit. Just tell me. I didn't do me like this. I don't even. Nah, I don't matter no more. You answered the question. You, didn't, you, didn't you can't wait to see Amanda Black. I can't wait to see Amanda Black. I'm gonna answer the question for you, girl. I got you. I can't do. I can't. Thing is, I really hope that I will be able to see other shows. Um. Yeah, I'm I'm trying to get there maybe like early, you know, a day before just to be able to no, to breathe to to we can talk Okay, cool. Come through so we can see how you're feeling before and after courtesy of people for one. We'll make sure. Yes. Thank you. Yeah. Last thing for the people at home, Instagram, Twitter, where we at? Hey guys, what's up? Follow me on Twitter, Instagram, it's Amanda Black SA. And I just want to say I love you guys and big ups to everybody who's still hustling out there and still trying. The hustle never stops even when you get here. So, um all the best and don't ever quit. I'm here today cuz I never quit. So, keep your friends close, keep your family close and make sure you get there. Thank you so much. I love you. Thank you so much, girl. It's been dope now, dude. Do your thing. You 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 holding the mic down nicely. <laughs>